what is going on guys welcome back to the channel film study for rookies today we're breaking down giants rookie quarterback tommy devito i gotta say i was pretty impressed by this guy we're gonna jump into the film take a look see what stands out to me see what stands out to you guys man let's jump into it so as we break down this first play what i love that tommy does right here is that he holds the mic right here right he doesn't let the mic know he wants to hit this five yard hitch on the inside so take a look what happens right here looking at the mic looking at the mic then bam the second this receiver is coming out of that cut, Tommy's ready to throw it, bang, bang. On top of that, let's say the mic plays that, right? Let's say the mic plays this, bam, seven yard slant right there as you're gonna see. Great game plan so far, let's keep it going. All right guys, this play right here showed me that Tommy has a nice touch on the ball. At first I thought he was going to the left, I thought the Giants were running a dagger concept. Instead, man, throws it to Barkley, what a catch, what a throw, let's break this thing down. So as we break this play down, at first I thought the Giants were gonna run a dagger concept, right? Take this receiver on a go route, bam, dig route underneath. Take a look what happens right here, right? Once the ball is snapped, I'm thinking, okay, perfect, dagger concept, Tommy's gonna hit this guy right here, right in the middle, bang, right? That doesn't happen, it looks to be a comeback route. So now Tommy has to scramble because a comeback route, it would be close, DB's on him, those are too far to the outside, he's got that too short, bam, he's got that, right? So he's gonna scramble. Great stuff by Barkley right here. Barkley's gonna see he's scrambling, gets on top of the DB, man. Good stuff right there, and since Tommy's scrambling, this DB is like, all right, do I go after him? Do I watch my guy? And the touch on this ball, man, the touch on this ball, on the run, hey, that's a good look right there, let's keep it going. On this play right here, it's third down, they bring Barkley in motion, he's looking to his left, doesn't see anything, gets pressured and takes the sack on third down. Let's break this play down, see was anything open or not. So as we look at this play pre-snap, commanders are gonna go into a cover three. Bang, 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 right? They're gonna have four underneath defenders. We're gonna pause it at the top of his drop, right? We're gonna pause it right here. Now his only throw potentially is probably gonna be the inside guy right here. He'd have to put that ball on the money right there. Now that's assuming the linebacker right here doesn't read that and go for it too. Other than that, my only thing would be, hey, if the commanders are dropping everybody back, just check it down to Barkley, let him do his thing, right? For the most part, nobody was open, but if you see the defenders bailing right, drop him back, just give it to Barkley, let him do his thing. Not a terrible play, because if you look over here as well, commanders force this receiver in, right? They're playing cover three, force him in, he's not really gonna be able to get open. Not the best play, but not the worst play. Let's keep it going. All right, guys, right here is gonna be another third down play. Now they don't convert. But what I like right here is that he didn't hold on to it and try and throw it deep right and get the first down. He gave his guy a shot, right? As you're going to see, there's pressure at the top of his drop. He's got to get rid of it. Really, nothing was going to be open, right? Let the play develop. Nothing was going to be open. Maybe hit your outside guy right here. Maybe. But again, there's pressure. I'm not mad at this throw. He's got to get rid of it. Let's keep it going. All right, guys. Right here, we see the commanders drop into a cover two. And look at this throw. Look at this throw, the ball placement, the throw, the touch on it. I mean, this is, whoo, this is what has me sold on him, right? Now, maybe I'm speaking too early, but I like everything about this play, right? You got this guy going deep, bam, hit him underneath, as you're going to see. Take a look at this. Whoo, got him. I mean, that's just beautiful right there, guys. That is beautiful right there. I thought for sure, maybe he was going to go for this receiver right here, split the seam. Nope, instead, goes underneath. And look at that hole, right? He has to put that thing on the money right there. Two DBs closing in on it, and that throw is money, man. Right in the bread basket. That's a hell of a throw. Let's keep it going. So in the last play we watched, it showed me that Tommy has great ball placement. Right here, he's going to look off the safety, and then look at the touch he puts on that ball. That is crazy. Take a look at this again, all right? So as we break this play down, here's what I like about Tommy right here. As the play develops, you're going to see Commander's going to a cover one look, right? Now, Tommy has to be careful. He can't give it away that he wants to hit Barkley. Giants do a great job using the big guy right here, right? Take a look. The big guy is going to occupy the safety. Tommy's looking at the big guy, then all of a sudden switches to Barkley. And look at that touch. Look at the touch on that ball. Everybody did their job really well right here. Tommy's looking at the tight end right here. Safety's occupied with that. Then, bam, at the last second right here, bam. Looks at Barkley and throws it. He doesn't hesitate. He doesn't take another step, right? No pump fake, no hitch in a step, nothing, right? Bam, looks at Barkley, throws it. Good stuff right there. All right, guys, on this play, this is one where I thought Tommy 
potentially left a pocket too early. I think he had a couple guys open. Let's run this back. Let me know what you guys think. So as we break this play down, we see two high safeties. Could be quarters right. Could be cover three. Could be anything, right? So as the play develops, we're going to see cover one with a robber underneath. Now, I think Tommy potentially wanted to go here, but he sees the safety drop down. My only thing is, then hit number 17 right here, right? A little chip, as you're going to see. Watch this receiver right here. A little chip, bam, hits the edge guy. I'm shocked Tommy didn't go to that. To me, he gives up on the play a little too early. There's pressure coming, but I think he could have hit his receiver right there. Let me know what you guys think. Let's keep it going. Right here, a little rub concept with Barkley. Bang, bang. Good stuff right there, man. I like what they're doing with this offense. I've seen great play calls. They're spreading Barkley out. They're getting him the ball. Get your playmakers the ball. So many offenses aren't doing that. Giants so far look pretty good. Let's keep it going. On this play right here, Tommy's going to watch the mic. Bam, the mic goes with the running back. Just check it underneath. Check it underneath. Tommy so far, man, pretty, pretty, pretty good, right? Take a look at this again. Watching the mic, sees the mic pick up the running back. Knows he has the middle of the field wide open, right? Middle of the field wide open. Good stuff right there, man. I mean, there's not a lot to say. This is just textbook. This is just textbook. I mean, you're going to see a three-step drop. Bang, bang. Steps into the throw. Good stuff right there, man. Once again, here's another play that shows you the Giants, man. The play calling. It looks good, right? Look how open he is. Look how open he is. So as we break this play down, 83 is going to motion. Bam, 31 is going to follow. Now that tells Tommy most likely man to man coverage. Now watch what else happens right here. They run the play action. Everybody's gonna bite down. Now that's gonna cause a lot of congestion down here in the box, all right? Now take a look what happens next. Man to man coverage. This guy's supposed to pick up this receiver right here. But take a look at this receiver, right? Take a look at this. Basically a pick route as you're gonna see, forces him to go all the way around. Take a look at this. Forces him to go up all the way around. Tommy sees that. And look at that separation. I mean, that is crazy. The move, the separation, the catch. I mean, look at this. Look how open he is. And as he's about to catch this, look at homie cheering right here. He knew he ran the perfect play. He did his job perfectly. Six on the board, man. The Giants? Not too shabby. Let's keep it going. All right, guys. Right here is going to be our last play. I hope you guys have enjoyed the video. Once again, man, the touch on this ball that he has is just crazy. Look at this. Lays it out there for the running back, and it's six on the board. That touch, it's just wild, right? Take a look at this again. The touch on this ball, man. Woo! Good stuff right there. I hope you guys have enjoyed the video. Honestly, man, I like Tommy a lot. Let me know what you guys think. I'll catch you guys on the next one.